What's good YouTube? Your boy Bosco back again with yet another sneaker video. Hopefully you're having a great day wherever you are in the universe. Been a long time bro since we've been able to do this with something fresh and new. The stores have just opened back up. I'm very excited. Hopefully you guys do enjoy the video and we got some catching up to do. Yes indeed by the title you already know we're talking about the Kyrie 6 Enlightenment. This is a shoe that I think is pretty dope and interesting. A lot of things I like about the shoe. I want to give you my perspective on the shoe and then you guys can let me know in the comment section below. We can go ahead and do an up close and personal review on them. Of course, maybe even an on feet. But let me know your thoughts and opinions. Smash the like button. Watch the video all the way to the end, of course. And if you happen to like the video, smash the like button, of course. That's what you got to do. And subscribe with notification bells on to be updated every single time I drop some content. Without further ado, let's get to what's in this box, you dig? We have a Kyrie 6 Enlightenment, which is an oldie but a goodie. It looks pretty dope, looks a lot better in person. I can't wait to get these outside and see how the light hits them because they're they have it had the purple undertone, as you know. But before we get into the box, I need to let you know merch is now available. I have my samples coming in, but they are fire. Shout out to everybody who has copped already. Um, link in the description for the drop 31 and drop 34, or you can just scroll down right below the video and you'll see a little bit of what I have to offer. Go ahead and check it out. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on it. If you can cop some merch, cop some merch. And uh, if you do, go ahead and send me a picture of you copping it or getting it on Instagram or Twitter, however you follow me. Of course, I will repost it and maybe even share it in the video. But without further ado, let's go ahead and open this box. Like I said, it's a shoe we've all seen before. The Enlightenment or the Grand Purple, which it was called before. Now it is called the Enlightenment. This right here is actually a size 12. Was not able to get this in my size, but I definitely wanted to get my hands on these and review them. And I believe somebody might even try these on. The lacing is not factory, this and that, but it is indeed a dope shoe and we're gonna talk about it. That's why I'm pulling it out here. The box is the typical box, nothing special about the box. That's why we're not really gonna review that. And like I said, you might have seen other people review the shoe. You know what I mean? You might have seen other people review it, but maybe not like me. Maybe not have the passion to talk about these like I do. The Kyrie 6 is a dope silhouette overall, bro. You cannot go wrong with this shoe. This colorway is dope. It looks from a distance maybe black or maybe even navy blue. Or you might even see the slight purple. But for the most part, you'll think this is a black shoe. The closer you get to it, you'll see that nice overtone or undertone of purple. And I'm assuming when the light hits it, the sunlight hits it, it's really going to pop. Which we will show you in the up close and personal features. Uh, of the shoe, maybe even an on foot. I don't know if I can squeeze my foot into this. This is a size 12. I'm a 13. Kyrie's run pretty small, so maybe there will not be an on feet. I don't know. That is remains to be seen. But this shoe is dope, bro. The suede on the back panel is something I really like. Uh, they give you a stitched in Nike switch, which is something I really enjoy when they do that as opposed to like a plate or a sticker. This also has that all seeing eye underneath. It's very lightly there. You can see it. It's blade is day, you can see it, but it's lightly, like you have to look close in order to really catch the all seeing eye. It's kind of like hidden, if you will. Uh, the enlightenment, let you know what's going on, actually. The strap is something I like. I love the color of the strap on this shoe. This shoe was pretty dope, man. They did, they did a good job with the color combinations. The only thing I don't like is the tongue. Like, I don't like the color combination on the tongue. The yellow, red, the blue, and the green, or the yellow, red, and the green that's there. It is on the rest of the shoe, but I just don't like how the yellow looks on the tongue. I don't know, that's just my personal opinion. But I do love the purple on the tongue with the red popping in the back. You know, red's my favorite color, so anytime I can add that to the shoe, I'm gonna be all for it. Uh, if I had to rate these from a one to 10 score, to be honest with you, these are probably a solid seven, maybe seven and a half. Not something that I would have to rush to go get, but it is very dope uh, at the same time. And I will put it up against a few other shoes out there. Uh, just because of the trickery. You think it's one thing, but when you get closer, it's something else as far as the colorway. Um, I think this is fire. If you did a lace swap with them, maybe red laces might look good. Maybe we'll try that. White laces might pop on this shoe. Um, you know, they have green here stitching, but I don't know how green would really set. I don't think I have a green, this color, green color lace anyway to go ahead and do the lace swap. So maybe lace swap might be added to this video. Just give me your thoughts and opinions and let me know what you guys think. I had to review them, they're pretty dope. Uh, maybe at some point, you know, I'll be able to cop these for myself in the right size. 
because this could be a, like an everyday type of wear shoe because the Kyrie 6 is a dope shoe if I'm able to find it in the right size that's comfortable. Uh, but I've heard a lot of good things about the shoe as far as on the court. I haven't been fortunate enough myself to hoop, but I will be. Uh, but yeah, give me your thoughts and opinions. What do you guys rate these Kyrie Enlightenments from a 1 to 10 score? And uh, just give me your feedback, bro. If you enjoyed the video or liked the shoe, smash the like button, of course. Share the video with everybody else you know on social media, whether it's Twitter or Instagram. I'm on those platforms also. And uh, if you happen to be new, make sure you subscribe with notification bells on to be updated every time I drop a video, bro. Without further ado, let's get to the highlights. Maybe the on feet, and I'm out of here. I'll see you in the next one. Deuces.